Greetings, true friends. Today I want to announce a project I'm about to commence this summer. But before I begin to do so, I would like to first and foremost offer a sincere and heartfelt thank you to a certain Canadian true friend who, when he saw the leftists celebrating my demonetization from YouTube, he got angry and he wanted to show some support, so then he contributed to this whole operation with a highly generous contribution. And I talked with him afterwards and he said that he worked quite hard non-stop for two weeks to, um, to be able to do this, so uh, I'm beyond humbled for uh, this kind of support. And then also to everyone on uh, Patreon and Subscribestar who has um, contributed to the channel, it uh, truly means the world and yeah, it literally means that I can continue making videos. So again, thank you from the bottom of my heart to everyone who has contributed. Now, my summer project, I was initially going to announce this earlier, but then the whole censorship thing broke loose and uh, yeah, I had to tackle a lot of other things, but the plan is still going ahead. So I would also like to offer a thank you to Arctos and Logik for Lag, and I will show what I say thank you to in a bit. So basically what my announcement is that I will start making videos on Swedish history. So it will be a sort of mini documentary series and I will start small and then build up and the last episode, well it won't be the last, but it will be a longer and a bit more professional looking video which will be released in a little film festival here in Sweden that my friend Jonas of Palestra Media is uh, doing. So that will be in um, at the end of September. So that will be a film of Gustav the third of Sweden, my favorite king. But up until then I will make some smaller videos training my documentary skills in the process. So that is what you have to look forward to. I will continue to make regular videos because there's a lot of topics that I have wanted to talk about for ages. So I'll get those done as well. And some more Games Kitchen and some more training videos. So the video production will continue as uh, before, but I will also make some uh, longer and a bit more um, elaborate videos. So if I don't make so many videos one week, you know I'm out filming and producing content for more in-depth history videos. And yes, about the gift from Arctos, they were kind enough to bestow upon me these fine tomes of knowledge. So it's a... Um, these are quite controversial in Sweden now, because they are politically incorrect. They um, don't portray Swedish kings as villains, they are portraying Swedish kings as they were heroes. So looks like that. That's Gustavus Adolfus. You might recognize him from Sabaton's album. And then the most aesthetic book cover is uh, this Love That Armor. Absolutely aesthetic. And uh, so I will read through those. I'm currently reading this fine term of knowledge. Thank you to Logik for log for this. Um, I haven't read it all, but I can still recommend it um, already. It's also a non-politically correct version of Swedish history. So that basically means really Swedish history. So I'm reading through this. I have looked at some locations near Uppsala, Stockholm and uh, Västergötland, Östergötland. Uh, that's basically middle of Sweden. So I have some locations where I will go to film. I have some topics and it will be based upon certain individuals, certain places, certain events, so that will be the theme. And I thought about just telling the story of Sweden to non-Swedes, or to other Swedes for that matter, but uh, the channel has always been in English, so I want to keep it in English, because the majority of support I have is from the Anglosphere. So I want to give back good content um, for all the good support I've had over all these years. So that's basically what I want to do, and it's important for me to tell the story of Sweden, because as it is right now, I think most people only know about the Vikings and then the current predicament, but there is so much in between, uh, so much deep history that I just want to show you and tell you about. And I started thinking about this project a while back when uh, I basically said to myself, enough is enough, when I saw 
continuous attacks upon not only Swedish history, uh, but British history and American history and German history, everything like that. I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. So I thought, okay, let me do something. I ask myself every day, what can I do for my country? I've asked this question to myself for about 10 years now, and uh, sure, I can't do everything, but I can do something. What I can do at this particular moment in time is... Uh, yeah, to, um, to tell the story, to promote our history in a good and sound way. So I won't try to make it overly romantic or anything like that. I will just try to tell it how it is and uh, yeah, people can analyze it how they see fit. But uh, what I don't like is the constant attacks upon European history, the constant attempts to make it into something else, make it into something that is obviously not true. So yeah, that is my project for um, for the coming time. But as I said, I will continue to make regular videos. This is just something I will do as well. It will give me a great chance to just see some more of the country as well, to get more familiar with my own country. Because I say to you all the time that you should read up on your history. And you don't only need to read up on your history, you can obviously partake in when people make documentaries etc. And another motivating factor for me was that I a while back searched for content on YouTube and thought to myself what kind of content do I want myself? And these sort of mini documentaries that are well made, highly appreciated to watch. So I thought I will contribute to the great enlightenment by doing this. Now of course my initial plan was to do a little fundraising for this as well, then I already had my fundraiser when I got demonetized, so I'm not really comfortable talking about it again, and this is something that everyone who's not a content creator must understand. It's not something fun to ask for um, for funds. It's not something fun to ask for financial contributions. Uh, but I wouldn't do it unless it was necessary. So if you do appreciate the work and if you think a documentary series or a mini documentary series sounds interesting, I would yeah definitely appreciate some help either on Patreon or Subscribestar as a monthly support. But also if you would like to just finance this documentary series, you can do so as well. All the links are in the description box below. And for all Swedish followers, I have my Swish number there as well. So um, mark it with documentary if you think it sounds like a good idea. It's uh, truly heartfelt. And again, to all of you who has already contributed, again, you're watching this right now because of your support. So yes, that is the coming plan and lastly before i forget if you are a musician if you want to aid in this um, documentary series i would very much indeed appreciate if you can send me swedish sounding music or classic sounding music or anything you think would be good to have in a documentary uh, or a mini documentary so if you have some music you would like me to get in the videos that you think would suit well if I'm talking about something. So it can be if I'm talking about a medieval rebellion or if I'm talking about the Enlightenment period. Uh, if you have something, just uh, send me an email with the music. I am uh, very appreciative of that sort of things as well. And then also if you are an artist, if you want to create some art that I can use for um, this sort of stuff, if you want to make some sort of art I can use in the videos of Carolians or uh, medieval Swedish knights or uh, what have you, I'm also very appreciated for that. So that is my project. I will try to make it to the best of my abilities. It might be the case that I start off slow, but then I pick up the pace and I start making better things. But I have to start somewhere, so I will do that now. And again, if I get enough financial contributions, I will make some upgrades in my camera equipment as well. The current camera I'm recording this with is a is actually a Logitech 920 webcam. I've had that for about seven years now, but uh, it's a loyal companion so that stays with me. But when I'm out and about, I would probably be well off with a better camera. But that being said, I wish you a great day ahead. And who am I? I'm the Viking of Wisdom, XXO. Boom.